our Kata Ohana here. All the people of color leaders are here. Indigenous people from all nations came out. People from Alaska are here. Right here, Alaska. It's right. Aloha, Alaska. Aloha. Chicago's in the house. Aloha, aloha. Aloha. So many people out there. Yeah, red is That would be useful for like city. Cool. Is what people are doing. It's like, oh, it's like, <laughs> colonize our language. Let me see. Let me see your sign. Let me see your sign. Aloha Poke Code. No, it's give, modern give the colonialism. Give the Aloha not for sale. <laughs> Handing out Chashibau. napkins. What you got? Chashibau. Oh, yes, Auntie. Some. Auntie made us manakua. Oh. Stop misappropriating our language and our culture. All right. I don't, you know, frankly, I don't have any problems with other people appropriating our language and culture because we share. We share. But it's misappropriation when they try to tell us. We, we cannot, cannot use it. Yeah. Right, Uncle. And they try to trademark it. That's just not right. Right, Uncle. You are right, Uncle. <laughs> a beautiful experience I tell you. Yes, you everybody. This is not over. It's Tasha Lehoku and we are here from Lace Poke Stop in Anchorage, Alaska to deliver our petition from our people, almost 200,000 people from around the world in support of this movement for the Aloha Poke Company to rescind their trademark and stop using the words Aloha and Aloha Poke in their business. Um, we have tried this entire week to, to deliver this petition and our declaration, the Powell Kalani Declaration, to the corporate offices and we were unable to find the corporate office here in Chicago. And so we are, we are here at the Clinton, the original Aloha Poke Company, here to deliver this uh, to the employees inside in hopes that it will get to Chris Birkinshaw or anyone from the corporate offices of Aloha Poke Company. So follow us. I'm going to be going live in a bit. Thank you. Thank you. Thank 
here can help us deliver this in another way and so as you can see we just wanted to share our aloha and make sure that we were able to give this one location um, and hopefully Chris will respond to that Chris Birkinshaw the CEO of Aloha Poke Company or their representative or someone um, can call me I've left my number my information with the lawyers who um, who represent the Aloha company, uh, Poke Company and I still haven't received any calls from them or emails or any kind of uh, correspondence but we are here for a little uh, a little bit longer but we will make sure that our Chicago Ohana um, will take care of this for us so mahalo for watching everyone um, if you are just jumping on we just left the French market here in Chicago 
131 North Clinton, the Aloha Poke um, company that inside that is on the trademark, the license that is on the trademark. I, I believe this is the first Aloha Poke company that opened. And we came to share our declaration, give them a copy of our declaration, the Paul Kalani Declaration, as well as our petition. Um, in support of this movement. All right, so stay tuned. We have a couple more events this evening and we'll be back live. Mahalo. Aloha, no, no. Aloha, poke, no. Aloha, no, no. Aloha, not for sale. Aloha, no, no. Aloha, poke, no. Aloha.